I'm Robert with Habitat for Bats. I'm out on a nature walk here doing videos for you guys. Hope you appreciate them. Got a question here. It says, do bats live in a bat house year round? The answer to that is generally no, uh, but it depends on the species. It depends on your location. If you're in the south and you have Mexican free tails that have moved in, then the odds are that the bats are actually going to migrate in the winter and head south and stay active year round. If you have a couple of different species, like little brown bats, for example, odds are they're probably gonna migrate and move a little further north, find a cave and hibernate. They're not gonna stay in it, but we're in Georgia. We have seen bats roosting in bat houses year round. Uh, big brown bats, I've noticed a lot of those tend to roost in bat houses year round. They also roost in attics and farm equipment. It's not uncommon to get a call in January, someone was working in their attic or, or cleaning up or doing something with farm equipment. Sometimes farmers call and they found a, a, a bat or multiple bats in a bat house and, uh, or in farm equipment. Uh, and they wanna know if the bat's okay, if they should do anything, why it didn't go away for the winter. We have very mild winters here usually, so there's no concern over it. That's just how that species of bat behaves. Also, uh, bats that don't use bat houses will stay around for the winter. We have red bats and they seem to just stay in the forest year round. Uh, when it gets cold, they just get into the trees a little tighter, go into kind of this torpor state and, and in a way hibernate right where they are. But here we can have a 75 degree day on January 1st with bugs flying around. So the bats, uh, I've actually seen them come out and fly around and feed in January here. The further north you go, the colder it gets, the more likely they're gonna go somewhere and hibernate or possibly try to head south and stay active year round. Always inspect the bat house closely before you service it. If you need to repaint it or do something to it in January, get a bright light, shine it up inside of it. Look for any lumps in the corners, anything like that. Make sure it's not a bat. And if you find bats, just leave it alone. Just, just leave it there and let the bat do its thing and keep checking. You'll probably find one day that it's just moved on and, uh, or a small group of bats have moved on. But definitely don't mess with a bat house that uh, has bats living in it at the time. So I hope that answers your question. Uh, please like and subscribe and we'll be bringing you more videos as we go.